Tommy, a draw here tonight, but a really convincing performance from the Lily Whites. What did you think? Um, exactly that, I thought. Uh, we're just disappointed we didn't come in half time a few more goals up. We got in some good areas. Um, and as, you know, the second half, they've got a lot of fresh legs that have come on. But for us, again, it's just stepping in the right direction from Saturday. The important thing was not to go from the build up that we, you know, we sorry, from the uh, performance we put in on Saturday to start dropping the levels. And I thought tonight, I mean, the work rate for everyone was like second to none. I thought we really worked hard. But the only thing that I've said to the boys, we've got to kick the ball a little bit better. We just give it away a few too many times, too cheaply for me. But, but again, we've got in some great areas tonight and perhaps could have had a few more goals. Yeah, the first half, the first 10, 15 minutes, we just couldn't put a pass together, we couldn't get out. But as we settled into the game, it seemed like we could really go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a team that are two divisions above us as well. And like you said before, some of these players can play at that level when a bit higher. But what you know, were you happy with the resilience from the boys as well when they were sort of under the cosh? Yeah, I don't think we was under the cosh. I don't remember Jacob making a save. Um, but yeah, we've, we've, you know, we've played against a good team tonight. So it's not always about us. Like I said to the boys, it's not going our way. That's when we've got to collectively get together and, and work things out. But again, the majority of the stuff, from my point of view, come from us giving the ball away cheaply. We won it, give it back, won it, give it back. They've played some good stuff. But overall, I mean, I've, you know, I've counted three or four good chances in the first half where we should have really put the game to bed. So, um, no, there's loads of positives to come from the performance in the second half. Um, I thought, again, we got in some better areas um, that we perhaps could have pulled the trigger. But again, it's just that little sloppiness of the choice of pass, which sort of was the only sort of, you know, little, little bit of a uh, negative for me tonight. But um, I'm not going to fault the work rate because, again, we've played against a very good team tonight. Moving on, we now know who we will be playing Glebe in the first game of the season at home here. The rest of the fixtures have not been released yet. We do hope it happens this week. But how do you feel about playing Glebe, that, you know, a team that when um, you first came in, it was one of your first few games, wasn't it, as well? And it was, uh, yeah, second game. Yeah, it was your second game. And, and um, it was one of those games where it was a real test of fire. Do you feel like that's going to be the same test again? Uh, no, I think, on, I, I think the difference is I've got people like him turning up. So I've got, you know, I've got players back in now. Last year I come in and it was in the second game. So, uh, but to be fair, I've always held my hands up. I didn't think we played well at all on that day. So um, I've got no, and Cleve were a good side. Obviously they've had a lot of um, chopping and changing over there as well. So they might be a different kettle of fish this year. I, I don't know. And as I've just said to the uh, reporter there, all I'm going to do is concentrate on us um, and make sure we're right. Um, we respect everyone we play and Glebe will get the same treatment as anyone else but yeah on paper they'll be uh, one of the teams that are supposedly like one of the favourites along with us so uh, yeah we'll see. That's the thing about non-league is the, the, the teams do change as well. Moving into Saturday, strike force who we have got in the cup and it is you know it's going to be a bit of a derby are you, are you looking forward to that game and seeing what they're going to be like before we play them in the cup? Um, yeah I mean it's a local derby for, for me it's about um, the progression with the performances you know, in, prepar in preparation for the Glebe game. Um, but Strikers will get exactly the same treatment as Hastings did tonight, and everyone, we expect everyone we play. Obviously, on paper, we're the favourites, but I think we're going to be the favourites every week this season. So, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to the game. It is a local, obviously, with ground share. Um, I hoping there's a few here, which is the main, you know, the main thing for the football club. Um, again, the town comes out as a town and gets behind Fabersham for the season. But for us, it's about the progression. So if we can build on tonight, perhaps keep the ball a little bit better and be a bit more ruthless, then, um, then we're not a million miles away.